Hey, what's up guys, Dan here. Welcome to a new episode of Race to Rio. Now, this is episode 8. We've got those Argentinians in the team, full non-rare silvers. They look really good. And before we even start, please go check out utcoinfew.com. Their links will be down below. And you can use the code Mr. Inferno to get an extra 5% off on top of that. So make sure you do that. And we come up against this team in the first game. They've, he's got two Team of Year players, including Inform Fernandinho and Inform Date Diego Costa. Great players. And can we hit a like on this video that would be brilliant we do get a chance in the fourth minute to make it 1-0 to me but it's straight at the keeper and we couldn't make it 1-0 so in the next chance we've got in the 15th minute just shortly later we do get some nice footwork from Cardozo and he has a shot which is saved by the keeper again so we nearly made it 2-0 already in the 16th minutes but um, we can't do so and in the 20th minute his first chance of the game he does get a shot and it goes right into the bottom corner we're really unlucky to concede that so we're 1-0 down it's not the worst of worst but um, he's got a really nice team so we can't complain but um, he gets a chance here and he buries it with Diego Costa nothing worse could have happened it rebounded off my keeper and that's how it ended at half time 2-0 to him and it's been quite equal actually he's had double my shots and the possession has been fairly equal so we've got just to go into the second half and hope for the best basically we've got a decent team to do so so um, we do some nice footwork from Morales not uh, Kevin Morales but um Morales, the Argentinian, he does really well to get past a lot of players and it's a great goal. Make it 2-1, that is a thousand coins in the bank. So that was a really nice goal from him, one of the best of the series so far. But shortly after that, in the 53rd minute, he does get a chance and it's a great save for my keeper actually. And... Um, so he could have made it 3-1 to him cancelling the game out and he gets a chance in the 59th minute 6 minutes after that and um, I block it out actually but then a clinch just hits off him and it couldn't have come worse the game was against me this game I just knew I wasn't going to win it and that's 3-1 to him so it didn't look like we were going to win this game just because his team as well and it's a great save from my keeper there but he does the sort, same sort of save and it just rebounds to him again so he makes it 4-1 a bit of a route in the end and that's how it finished this game we still do get 1,000 coins which we will add the bonus up not just after this game but this after the second game and that, that's just something I should notify you about we can only play two games of this episode I did actually lose a game in the third game but I lost the clips because I had a power card so that's quite frustrating anyway we go on to the second game of this episode and he comes up, up with a team not so good as the last one but still he is quite a good player and he gets a chance there and he dinks my keeper making my keeper look stupid and if you enjoy this episode so far please drop a like on it can we get 75 likes that would be brilliant and um I, he gets another chance and he is just doing chipping for days 21 minutes in and he was 2-0 up I couldn't do anything about it either and that's how it ended at half time I didn't have a shot on target or even any type of shot and he had 6 and six and 6 on target so he was obviously doing a good work and um, he gets a chance in the 47th minute and he makes it 3-0 this is going to be a route and um, I get chance in the 60th minute actually however and um I do head it to my player and then it's a great finish in the end to be fair. 1,000 coins are in the bank so we've got to collect our 2,000 coin bonus already. And um, in the 65th minute he gets a free kick and to be fair it's a great goal from him. He makes it 4-1 uh, again and that's how it ended actually. 4-1 to him so we can collect 2,000 coins to upgrade a few players. And... Um, that's just we couldn't do anything about that loss either two great players we came up against and um, we just do collect our bonus right here and um, we can actually go on to upgrade our team we've got our non-rare silvers at the moment but it looks like we can upgrade them and um, we start off with Bizarre in goal who's actually a great goalkeeper and um, I think we can actually upgrade everything to a shiny silvers and we do so um, a lot of the players do have shiny silver player cards and um, in a CDM position we've got um, the QPR player and the team does look quite good now it looks like we can win some games in the next episode and um so i hope you enjoyed this episode of race to vo please give it a like rating and subscribe to my channel and comment down below of what you think so thank you for watching and have a nice day